A family in Indiana is desperate to figure out where their loved one is. 32-year-old Todd Allen disappeared nearly two weeks ago in Pasco County. ABC Action News reporter McKenna King is live near the area Allen was last seen. And McKenna, you talked to this family. What did they tell you? Well, Jasmine, the family tells me that tomorrow marks two weeks since anybody last saw Todd Allen and they've got missing person posters up all across the county like this one here at this bus stop bench. This is just outside the area where Todd Allen was last seen and the family says that area is at the Grove at Wesley Chapel. They say he was caught on surveillance footage just outside the Chuck E. Cheese up the street here. Now the Pasco Sheriff's Office issued a be on lookout more than a week ago. His family tells me Todd may have gotten into an altercation with a co-worker on his way to work on Monday, May 24th. His truck and keys were found shortly after in Wesley Chapel. His family says this is highly unusual for the 32 year old man. They say he has a girlfriend and four children and that he wouldn't just leave them. Todd would never go. I mean, if he's busy out in Florida and he's working a lot or whatever, he would go maybe three or four days tops without talking to my mom. Uh, he would go maybe a week at the most without talking to me no longer than that and especially if he was ever in any kind of trouble or anything i'm usually the number one me or my mom he would call right away just adding to the family suspicion in the case is that they say he never picked up his check from work, which totaled more than $3,000. Now, most of Todd Allen's family lives in Indiana. A lot of them have already come down for a search previously. That week he went missing. They stayed for about a week to search for Todd Allen, and they say they're just trying to raise some more money to come back down here to continue that search to hopefully bring Todd home. Of course, if you've got any details in this case, you're asked to call the Pasco Sheriff's Office. Reporting live in Pasco County, McKenna King, ABC Action News.